I mean, a project of this size is going to come with challenges. Yeah, it will do. You know, yeah. so that that's I think that we would be burying our head in the sands if we think that wasn't the case. So mm. I mean, I'm I'm well aware that there's going to be challenges, but I think just to get a concept yeah. on the board, I think it's it's very exciting. This this blew my mind. This well, actually blew my I mind. Think, uh, it was the rooftop bar that blew my mind, which is probably <laughs> wrong. But that I'm just being honest. The rooftop bar that had me. That that I, I I was I was I was absent the rest of the meeting. I think I was on the rooftop bar. Um, I don't know. Uh, I don't know about Kylie certainly, but it's not a kind of project that comes into the office that we get to get involved with much. Aye. And Kenny straight away said, "Right, this is for you and Kylie." Um, and straight away, I was like, "That that's the right team to put onto it because Aye. it's what we do." compared to the other side of the office, which yep. do a lot of the, the more technical, detailed things. But Kylie and I are, are more of the, the design. Uh, well, I've been called a lot worse. <laughs> uh, but I, so, so straight away, you know, and then we have to figure out, play to your strengths, because, like I said, Kylie's very good on the computer. Uh -huh. um, and I'm thinking, right, well, how can I be good enough I, for Kylie uh -huh. to give her what she needs? So, Because when I was still a university everything I did was models. Right. Like I, I made physical models because I wasn't very good at doing the drawings, which right. has since developed um, being in practice. Yep. But Kylie's head and shoulders above me in, you know, using a computer. That's uh, it. Mm -hmm. So, but again, the difficult thing is I had an idea in my head of how I think how you it, think should, it should look. look. Mm -hmm. And then trying to convey that to Kylie and she's thinking oh, for crying out loud just let me do what I'm doing Aye. Um, but it's knowing uh, knowing Kylie well enough and knowing how good she is at what she does that she will get that concept and, Absolutely. and she'll make it her own and you put the, your strengths and weaknesses yeah. together yeah, yeah that's, we done a wee few that's drafts, our team draft sketches yeah. to see what it's going to turn out to and so and it, it's, it's well I think it's the second or third one that we've we've kind of had the chance to work on so anyway mm. Kylie's strengths then come right. into play. So yep. I, I do the, the line like drawings and then Kylie you know? then takes it and makes, you know, something really quite beautiful. Do you want to talk about it? Or um, go for it, Kylie. It? Tell, tell us. Give us it. Show us your drawing. Um, so this is just the site plan. So we can kind of see the new extensions to either side. So it's got like the glass connections. Glass connections here and yeah, then here and here. Delicate touches. Yep. So you can imagine as we like come up like this tree lined access um, and come into like the driveway, like, driveway and like the arrival. We come round this like, kissing tree, is what Bruce is calling yep, it. Yeah, I love it. Come round the it. kissing tree and we have all these spaces that we're utilising. Um, around the site for like photographs um, and places that like the wedding can go and like take Absolutely. pictures because you've got the site Instagrammable yeah, I think Instagram we were going to say it's like yeah. yep um, so we've got like this wee courtyard space and obviously we have to start thinking about like car parking so that's what is down further to the bottom yep and we're trying to kind of block that off maybe like with like um, hedges or yep something just to like hide it um, a wee bit so We've got like our entrance through and like just kind of starting to like think about like how the landscaping is going to start to go. And obviously you've got your rooftop bar up there and we can start to see like how <clears throat> that might look. That's me. <laughs> Are you at the fire thanks, pit? Thanks for, put, <laughs> thanks for putting me in there, Kylie. Um, There's me. There's Laura. <laughs> <laughs> We're not invited to this wedding. So we've we've we're waiting up here in the rooftop bar so we can join it. I'm Jump gonna end up giving a speech. I love sank a bottle of prosecco up here oh, and I'll end up giving a speech at this wedding that I'm not invited to. <laughs> <laughs> that looks amazing. Absolutely yeah. amazing. And that that's kinda of touching on what I was saying before. Like this is obviously the old the old building and then mm. the glass connectors just with the new buildings, it just all it just looks it looks good, doesn't it? It just doesn't look too harsh. Like it looks great. I just love that the old and the new are just meeting, and it's it's perfect. I love it. So the main benefit, or one of the main benefits of what Kylie's done is, you know, way back to when we did an analysis on the site, we said a lot of green space could be lost around the site, not for your development, but from other developments. So yep. you can see we've just shown a tiny wee patch of of what is green. There's so much greenery on that site, and down here you can see this is where we're thinking green roofs yeah so this block, block here if you're looking mm -hmm. at it from above you know you've still got that connection where it's not just this hideous new structure yep. sitting 
plank in the middle and of the under site. this is like the kitchen area for weddings yeah. and under the rooftop bar is the, the function, the function hall, hall yeah. which is going to be the new site for and in that zone so the uh, the tiled space yep so yep. that zone's your champagne bar which yep. then opens out onto your rooftop terrace and Amazing. we've shown that rooftop terrace is having a, a fire pit in the middle of it just now but again mm -hmm. as this develops and regulations come into place you know that is subject to change possibly we things like this your kissing tree maybe you, to get to the kissing tree you go through a moon gate yep. and that's mm -hmm. a couple standing underneath the moon gate the photographer's there taking photos got this wonderful tree the way this car's shown, if you can imagine that car coming another way, so the car's come round, and I'm parked here, and I'm seeing all the way through, and my nice glazed connection all the way through outside, and then we talked about having steps down to a kind of mid-level terrace, so yep. again, there might be, I don't know, a band playing, or tables and chairs, people having their drinks, things like that. It's ev using everything you've got on that site to give you everything that you need from your wedding day. Yeah. And then... I suppose the final image, the main image of how we feel it's going to look. So Ooh. there we are. This is uh, again. This is. We should have done a drum roll first. Missed the drum roll. Ben, you can add a drum roll on, can't you? Yeah. Go for it, Ben. Yeah. So again, I got to do the the kind of the simpler part of putting together a line drawing, which gives you a perspective of what we wanted to show. Um, we talked about having a three-dimensional image. We talked about how do we present something to you which really conveys everything that we are wanting to get through to you. Um, about our idea, about materials, about hierarchy of shapes, sizes, massing, all of that. Um, so I sat at the computer and I drew a, a crude line drawing and then handed it over to Kylie. And I think Kylie... Hopefully, has brought your dream to life with she's what she's it presented. With fairy dust. <laughs> yep, Let so, it fly. I love it. We were, love we it. were all blown away in the office. Um, like I said, we've had a couple of quiet days where she was head down and yes. ignoring me, ignoring anything. That she's drawing Cassie's birds here. She's, she's got, got Laura's white birds mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, again, and there's wee things like, uh, you know, it, it, it slopes down, so you show a gradient, you show mm -hmm. things that. Give you a bit of realism to, to the drawing, and I think I love it. I love that well. the pathway looks lit up. The pathway, yeah, yeah. like it, it it's amazing. The pathway's yeah. all lit up. You've got the terrace. Mm -hmm. I love even the yeah. colours in the building meets the new mm -hmm. meets the old. Like it just looks amazing. Like mm -hmm. yeah. see, even when you look at it on this drawing as well, it's hard to picture like this area and stuff. But then mm -hmm. when you see it like that, it's like oh god, I can't believe it's going to look like that. No. <laughs> it's just amazing, isn't it? It's absolutely amazing. Yeah, so that glass connection works both ways. It so does. if I'm standing down at the bottom, you know, I'm looking through a building and I'm seeing trees, I'm seeing... I'm surrounded by everything that that site has to offer, really. I, I, lo I love it. I absolutely love it. I just think it's fantastic. You've done an amazing job. Well mm. done, guys. Thank you very much. Do you have do you want any, anything well, to say about the your, main your thing masterpiece? I try to get across on this one is like the materials we're using as well. Um, like... We're thinking like timber clad and trying to match like the colours to like the existing stone as well. And then we're trying to think about like for the new extension, like maybe like a stone matching that, like the new Yeah. Just to um try and like bring a bit of harmony to it, I guess. Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. I love and that. The, the timber, um one of the, the things that we were discussing in the office was screening. Because if you've got this glass Yeah. And the sun's rising in the east and setting in the west. It's going to come right round the back of the site. So, you know, people in there having a lunch or getting married, how do you screen that? So, you know, it'd be a deep recess. So there'd be these natural timber slats that would screen you from the sun as the sun moves around the building. So, and that then, you know, brings with it something else that brings lovely shadows internally and things like that. So, Amazing. Absolutely amazing. But that, that's the concept and it's still very much in development. Mm -hmm. No, you better make this happen, Bruce. <laughs> and Kylie, don't forget Kylie. <laughs> yeah. This better happen, guys. This better happen. No, this looks absolutely amazing. Um, he's have done a smashing job, honestly. I kind of think he's enough. It's amazing. And I hope everybody else loves it as well. If anybody's got any questions, then please feel free to ask us. Um, like the guys are saying right now, this is a concept and this is exactly what we're trying to do. 
it may things may need to change yep. because the regulations are whatever. But this is exactly what we're set out today, and I personally love it. So follow us on social media, guys. We've got a website. We're on TikTok. We're on YouTube. We're on Instagram. We're on everything. So Gary and Tibber, Google us. You'll find us one hundred percent. Follow the journey, and we really, really appreciate your support. Thanks again. Thank you.